So before we observe any data, we start with what we call a prior. For simplicity, we usually set our means function to zero. That's this red line here. But what's really cool is that we also get this blue uncertain band showing us plus or minus two sigma around our prediction, which gives us a 95 confidence region for where our functions might be. Now, let me show you some examples from this prior distribution. See how they all wiggle around with those blue bands? That's simply how a function distribution looks like. When we actually observe some data points, things get really interesting. Watch what happens when I add this first red data point. Our distribution immediately changes to accommodate this new information. This updated distribution is called a posterior. Look at how the green line, our mean prediction, now passes right through our observation and the uncertainty bands shrink dramatically around that point. As I add more observations, one by one, our posterior keeps updating. The uncertainty is smallest near our data points and grows larger as we move away. This perfectly captures our intuition that we are more confident about areas we have observed and less confident about areas we haven't. 